Okay, John's got the new FlyPro X Jaguar box in his hand. It just came in the mail. Uh-oh. And there it is. Oh, yeah, upside down. Okay, hold that up a little closer. Let me get a look at that. There it is right there. Nice packaging. So let's take a look at it on the bench now. Yeah, that's pretty cool. John, what do you think about this? I like that packaging. Yeah, it looks pretty neat. Now, let's just uh, lay it out outside the frame, but in the same order that it's packaged. How about that? So here's all of the pieces laid out on the bench. The core of the X-Jaguar drone consists of a three-board stack called the 8-in-1 tower, which contains a 5.8 GHz video transmitter, MWOSD, SP Racing F3 flight controller, and four 30-amp ESCs mounted on a power distribution board. The bottom board is what powers the motors. This is actually four ESCs, and these are BL Heli-style 30-amp ESC so each one is 30 amps so that's a lot of power to drive such a small quad but it also has an SP Racing F3 flight controller that's a common flight controller that uh, you can use clean flight or beta flight or whatever you want on it and configure it very easily with the configuration tools and then over here is the combo video transmitter and OSD, similar to the Minim OSD, and configures about the same way. And it, this is very u unusual board that it has the video transmitter on it. And it's a 5.8 transmitter, 40 channels, and you can select between 25 and 600 milliwatts. The 8-in-1 tower structure only weighs 38 grams and is designed for use with racing drones, pocket drones, mini quadcopters, and other frames. It can be purchased separately from FlyPro or the affiliates. This has quite a power system because it boasts a thrust-to-weight ratio of 10 to 1. This is an extremely fast drone. The motors are very good quality, and I've seen them out on the market before. They are the RC in Power GT2205 2300 kV motors, and they come with clockwise and counterclockwise threads. The propellers that come with it are three blade props, and they are a 5x45. Five five. The frame itself is made up of several components. But I do know that the arms are, are really strong carbon fiber and they are four millimeters thick roughly. This is actually a 190 millimeter size frame. It's a standard sort of pod type frame but it does have an interesting head on it. The uh, head is actually shaped like a jaguar, thus the name. So the Jaguar with an open mouth, and there's his eye right there. And that protects the camera as well as allows to tilt the camera inside this frame. Now the whole thing is powered with an amazing battery here. This is actually a 4-cell, 1300 milliamp hour, but it has a 100C rating, so it can really produce a lot of current. And this battery is an ROC battery, so this is a common battery. You should be able to get it in the United States as well. The camera is a Runcam Swift, and this camera is a very good camera. It's, a, it's very similar to the HS1177 from Fox Ear, so this is like the same as that. It's a very well-known brand and is great for FPV. Good, good clean video and very low latency. Now this kit comes with everything but a receiver. And the reason for that is people have different style radios, different brand radios, and so each one of those brands would require a different receiver. So you just use the receiver that's compatible with your radio, but you do have to provide it. So I would say this kit would be considered to be receiver ready. So the overall weight of the complete system with the battery on it is around 510 grams and then it would weigh a little more if you added an HD camera. So look under this video in the video description for a link to the official product page for the FlyPro X Jaguar and there'll also be a coupon code there that you can use to purchase the Jaguar from the official link. Yeah.